yeah, yeah, yeah. This is Cassidy, the hustler. And right now I'm on Breaking Records Radio. And if you need your record poop, you know where to go, man. Keep it locked. Easy. So, hey, yo, hey, yo. It's your boy Monster Man Rocco. It's your boy Swagger Rock. This is Snack Ripper. And hey, you have to go to Don't Know. Master A. You are not rocking with the best. Breaking Records Radio. Breaking Records, man. Breaking Records Radio. Breaking Records Radio. Breaking Records. Breaking Records. Breaking Records Radio. Let's go. Breaking Records Radio. Breaking Records Radio. Breaking Records, man. Radio is like the place to be. I don't know. Fuck strange music, man. <laughs> right? Like with me, um, you know, um, I, I, I'm a little slow on social media, I guess. Like, I, I haven't actually gone back and, you know, followed all the artists I used to listen to. I'm slowly doing it over time, but um, I've always kind of been, like, the fan, you know, like, I would, just, I would just check up on an artist every, like, year or so and be like, what new have they put out, right? And then so that's how I came across the um, that last mixtape, Don't Trust Anyone, and I had that shit knocking for... Um, good damn near six months every day on my headphones, man. The bands on me joint and stuff, like... <laughs> But um, thank it, you, man. Thank you, thank you. And that's one thing I love, man. And is that's that... why I stay working. So whenever I know, like, um, I've been out for so long and got fans for so many different reasons that, and there's so much going on. And like I said, I don't have them as cheap behind me right now. So everybody might not be informed with what I got going on at the same time. But whenever you do search or whenever you do get curious and you look, there's always something new because I'm always working. Yeah. You know what I mean? And there's going to be plenty of music. Like the Barbarian mixtape I dropped, it got over 36 songs on it, just on the one mixtape. So that's like three albums worth of music. Yeah. And it's called the mixtape, but uh, the majority of the mixtapes we named is all original music. It's yeah. It's not like, you know, me just freestyling all the instrumentals. I mean, it might be some of those on some of the mixtapes, but the majority of the music is original music, too. And that way so you can new music out for people to get 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 familiar with what I got going on lately. Yeah, and then that way too you can put everything on the DSPs and stuff, right? So it's like it's just a cleaner way of working nowadays, especially if you got you're producing yourself in house production, all that stuff. It's like why wouldn't you do that? It just makes sense. Yes, sir. Word, man. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to the album Bars and Beats. One, uh, did you have a release date set for that yet? Not yet. I just started. I just started. Um, I just started really working on a project not too long ago, like uh, um, a few weeks ago. Oh, really? Like, I've been picking up, and it's been moving so fast, and I've been banging out so quick. Like all of them records that I sent you is like all of these things been getting done in the last few weeks. So holy shit! Um, the, the 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 timeline might be moved up a little bit quicker because the project could be done a little faster than expected. So I don't got the date on it yet because I, I don't wanna I don't wanna put it out there yet, but it's definitely coming real soon. Yeah, real real soon. Dope, man. That's real dope. I'm looking forward to that. That's crazy that all those songs have just been done in the last few weeks. Like, <laughs> you know what I mean? And just <laughs> well, just the shit. I, I know I might already said it. Not to um, keep saying, but in the meantime, in the between time, the Barry's time is available on all platforms. That's the the single off the, the the bars and beats right now where you can hear, you know what I mean, some of the music and get a taste of what, what's about to come. And actually, Barry Time was probably, I think it was my favorite joint out of um, out of the, the handful that I got. And there was a couple joints on there that were more like, you know, like instrumentally classic uh, Cassidy more so, but just Barry Time really, really like, Th- that thing just connected all the way through with me, and you fucking killed that shit. Thank you, man. Thank you. 